say hello. So we just left piano lesson. We're gonna grab some stuff out of this Target that we never go to. Um, and then we have some place to be that's a surprise to them. I'm also gonna grab some stuff for um, the show tomorrow. So uh, got some things, some loose ends that we're tying up. But feeling super duper good. Super duper good. And also like and subscribe and hit that notification bell. <laughs> He's on top of it. Thank you, baby. Thank what? you. Thank you. What are you talking about? That chick This is them. All the time. Why are y'all doing all this? I, I'm trying to crazy. Wait, why is that? Why y'all be touching each other? Why is that an S? What you talking about with the Tesla? Yeah. I I don't know. Did it say S model? Don't yeah. step in the water, please. Step over it. it said, is that uh? Kai, where are you at? Oh, okay, right there. I don't know what it said. Y'all hungry? Yeah. Yes, ma'am. I don't want my thumb in my Let's mouth. Let's see. I don't want my thumb in my mouth. No. Mm -hmm. I know. Listen, Kai always think you know something. You don't be knowing. I know. What you know? Hello. Hello. Say surprise. <laughs> Look, he's like. She the ran through that. Okay. Oh. It's a balloon. Yeah. You guys, it's show day. I'm getting my makeup done by the one, the only Patrick. My man is making his product in the background. He's making his main shit in his tight shirt. Um, I'm talking to, let me, I don't want y'all to see all my business. Oh no, I'm talking yeah. to Victory. This is, why don't you use Apple to memorize your passwords on the phone? David is wanting me to log in as Gmail. It's wanting, okay, it wants me to, it wants you to log in as who? It's a Gmail login as a user who set up this Uber for business. Okay, account. I'll do it, don't worry. I'm about to do all of it, hold on. Oh, he, we getting makeup in the ear. Y'all you, you, you know nothing about that. Ear makeup, period. You updated the password. Okay. Text me that. And then. So wait a minute. Can you not get into. I'm going to talk to you in a second. Oh, Jesus. These passwords. <laughs> So what's good fam? I am currently in the green room. Uh, for y'all that don't know, the green room is the area that people who are performing on stage wait in. Uh, it's down like, I don't know, I came down like three or four levels. I'm, I can't even hear the music no more and it's loud. <laughs> anyway, down in this basement, uh, it's really relaxing though. Just capture this mic, let me get my drink. Get my drink waiting on the uh, Get closer to the time. Y'all see the merch shirt. I know y'all seen it by now, but that's the merch shirt. It's going to cause an argument and then all our different sayings on it. Um, had on a white t-shirt and according to Angel, it actually looks better, but I want to wear my merch. Anyway, um, waiting on the show to start, just relaxing. Uh, it's been busy. We met VIP, took pictures with everybody, um, did a sound check, setting everything up. I'm so glad I brought an extra shirt because I was wet, sweating. Um, anyway, um, everybody seemed like they're here to have, well, of course they're here to have a good time, but I already told them if don't nobody else have a good time, I'm gonna have a good time. So, yeah. Met the owner, a really cool, really nice guy. Um, Angel, she's in the, uh, y'all know where Angel's at, where she stays at, she in the bathroom. Anyway, 
Um, it's gonna be a good one. I'm excited, really am. So if you didn't see Marcus and I on tour, you probably didn't know that we try to set a party vibe at the beginning. The music is crunk. Right now the audience is going off to back that thing up. And y'all already know, black folk, we can't, we don't act right. This is a picture of me and Marcus before we went upstairs from the green room. This is him going over the audience questions before he went out. I wanted to get his opinion because this was our first night. We wanted to make sure that we like answered questions that we thought we could do well on and that the audience would want to know. And he was getting ready to go out on stage. Ah, that was me backstage, tipsy, proud of my man. Giving my mother, my mother happy, happy birthday. One, two, three. Happy birthday to Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Dorothy. Happy birthday to you. Marquita. Marquita. Brisha. Start it off. So what's good fam, uh, Wednesday morning, met LAX, flying out to Miami, we just left the Delta Sky Club, that's where I was to get there. Some of their, uh, their food, it, it depends on which one you at, but most times where I go is subpar. Anyway, uh, about to go, my, it's, I could probably got like 10 minutes before my uh, flight starts boarding, I just need to go get me my traditional stop by get me a neck pillow that I'm not going to use. I never bring one because I never use it, but every time before I board, I'm always like, I'm going to need a neck pillow because I'm sleepy. I ain't going to use that damn thing. Anyway, about to go do that and get on this flight. Um, I know because I, what I can do because such a long flight is a edit podcast. But anyway, fam, I know it beeping is loud. I'll be back to y'all in a second. So Marcus and I traveled on two separate planes to get to Miami because the American Black Film Festival paid for my flight. And so I got guacamole and chips and chicken wings and a margarita while I waited for my husband to land in Miami. And I learned a different way to eat chicken wings because of Keith Lee. I had no idea you could just remove the bones from the chicken wings first. So now I don't leave any meat on the bones. It's great. Oh, there was a fly getting on my last nerves. But that chicken was so good. Actually, the food in Miami was pretty much fire. We ate a lot, but it was also extremely hot. So when it's that hot, I just feel like it's necessary to have tropical drinks and eat, you know, chips and guacamole. <laughs> What's up, fam? Landed early in Miami. Uh... I think I was supposed to originally get here, like, landed like close to 6, but it was like 5.09 when I landed. Um, I don't know how they pulled that off. Anyway, I didn't know that they uh, black lane driver was scheduled for me, so now, regardless, it looks like I'm going to have to wait Good afternoon, on this dude. This yeah. lady been making announcements the whole goddamn time. She, I, she finally stopped talking. I said, let me jump on here and talk real quick. But anyway, so I'm going to be looking out for this dude, and uh, hopefully I can hurry and get to the hotel and change and get to this event, the danger set. For that, as I mentioned with Nice Crowd, we also have a food festival that's coming up. We do lots of things. We are more than the, the, the American Black Film Festival. We have Avianta Honors. We have Avianta Global. We have a, a festival that we do in London in September. And just really exciting things. So hopefully you guys will check us out. Um, I have some cards here. And I should probably put my glass on because I can't. And I have to tell you, there was an amazing village in the lab cooking up this movie for you guys and the culture. 
and we are so excited to screen it for you tonight. All right? So, without further ado, I would like to invite some of my co-conspirators to come join me on stage, and I'm going to start with Mr. Or should I say, Dr. Stephen Love? <laughs> Co-writer and producer, Tony Rittmeyer. <laughs> Man, Natari Turner, producer. <laughs> My brother. Another producer, Mr. Mark Wright. My colleague and partner, Mr. James Lopez. My other colleague and producer, Mr. Poppy Hanks. This amazing actress, Tiana Harris. My brother. Oh, she did. And one of our leads, Mr. John Boyega. Oh, he didn't change clothes. And we have to acknowledge our other co-star and fellow producer, Jamie Foxx. And without further ado, we'd like to invite our leader. What's good, fam? I'm on my way back to the hotel, me and Angels and Gap in the sheet. Got on my outfit, feeling crisp and clean. Look at this. Freaking marinara sauce from some mussels we were eating splattered all over me. I was breaking, opening one of the shells to the uh, to one of the mussels, and the thing broke, and the crap just got all over me, y'all. Am I zoomed in? Um, anyway, so we got to go to a, we about to go to another premiere. Walking back to the room in a rush so I can change. I'm so annoyed. It's a nice outfit. I'm not. The shorts ain't gonna stain. I've spilled stuff on these before. It'll wash out. The shirt is new. Hopefully, it don't stain. But uh, I was more, more disappointed. I ain't, ain't nobody get to see this outfit. Anyway. All right, fam, just got out of another movie premiere. Well, it wasn't a premiere, but it was uh, a screening. Well, screening, whatever, mm -hmm. whatever it's called. Uh, <laughs> headed on back to the hotel. I'm gonna relax, figure out what we gonna do. Yeah, here we are. That's all I got to say. <laughs>